So what's going on? Ian Dandroid here, and this is our, my very first Q&A uh, video blog. So, question, what does healthy and fit look like? Um, answer, we're going to go over that now. First off, why is it important to actually know what healthy and fit looks like? Um, to have this fundamental reference point of something that we're working towards every single day, uh, that's super, super important because then we know exactly what habits we need to create, who that person looks like to be healthy and fit, what meals and uh, nutrition we have to intake, uh, and how we have to move and exercise. So understanding what health and fitness is and then working towards that every single day. So my definition of health and fitness might be slightly different to you, but this is what I believe health and fit should look like. One, um, you have to have energy. You have to feel good. Okay, Being healthy and fit is about feeling energized so you can go and enjoy your life a lot better. That's what I believe anyways. So when you wake up in the morning, you're not tired, you're not lethargic, you're springing out of bed, uh, feeling energized so you can take on the day. Throughout the day, um, I mean, we're all humans, so we might go through uh, some energy drops here and there, but pretty consistently we're feeling good. Uh, and that's a day-to-day -day thing. So. A lot of people I work with, they come in, they're tired, they've got no energy, they haven't exercised in a long time, they haven't moved their body. Um, so for me, to get them to that health and fitness goal, I have to work on boosting up their energy. So let's just agree, at being healthy and fit, there is a component of feeling good and energized. Two, a movement and exercise component, okay? Um, again, a lot of people come to see me, they're a little bit weak, they're prone to injuries because they've got a weak lower back, a weak core. If we're looking at someone who's healthy and fit, they're going to be strong through uh, a variety of areas, whether that's lifting your own body weight, so body weight strength, um, lifting weights, so you have the strength to lift weights, strong core, strong lower back. Um, if for some reason you had to go for a 10k run, you know, not a big deal. So having that uh, variety and being able to fit, be fit through uh, a ton of different areas. That's what I feel is healthy and fit. Um, not being really a slave to just strength, just bodybuilding, um, just running. So a broad uh, variety of kind of physical skills and then working on those piece by piece. So we can agree energy, um, good quality uh, exercise program, and then we go to the final pieces, lifestyle, okay? Uh, a healthy and fit person manages their lifestyle, meaning you know, they go out and they do have fun, but they're not drinking every weekend. Um, you know, they might have the occasional late night, but they definitely monitor their sleep and they're on top of that. They're active, so you're getting out, being active, um, which for the reality, a lot of people, they don't get to experience that. So now that we kind of have a fundamental understanding of what is health and fitness, we know that it's um, feeling energized, it's having a good uh, exercise program, and it's following uh, all the things that involve a healthy lifestyle, okay? Once we understand that, we can start to one, map out what does a day in that look like, okay? That's something that I'll go over with you guys because once you understand what health and fitness is, the next step is putting your goals and then working towards those goals. So um, I hope that video was helpful and I hope it kind of gives you guys a better understanding of what health and fitness is so we can start working towards it. And I'm going to help you guys out. Um, like I said, that's my goal is to put out solid information to get you guys into the best shape of your life. Thanks very much, and I'll chat to you guys soon.